morning, friends. It's Miss Terry, and I have an apple here that I'm going to use to help us talk a little bit about God. Um, that might seem a little odd, but just hang in there for a minute. All right, so there's some things that we say about God. We call God our Father. We call Jesus God's Son. But he's also God. And then last week we learned about the Holy Spirit. So let me take a little trip over here to my words. I have three words here. The first word is a tricycle. Do you know what a tricycle is? A tricycle is something you ride, and how many wheels does it have? Three. A triangle, that's the second word, is a shape. How many sides does the triangle have? Right, three. And triceratops, that's a dinosaur, and that dinosaur has three horns. Tricycle, triangle, tri Ceratops. Those first three letters, try, mean the number three. When we talk about God, we talk about try un. Try meaning three, and un meaning one, like uno when you play the card game uno. So we say God is three in one. God our Father, Jesus the Son, and the Holy Spirit, those three parts of God. It's kind of like people. We have different parts that we play in life, different things that we do. For example, I'm a mom, I'm a wife, I'm a sister, I'm a daughter, I'm an aunt, I'm a niece. I have lots of different ways people see me, and you probably do too. Let's take a look back at my apple. When you cut the apple open, you can see that it actually has three parts. It has the skin on the outside that protects the apple and everything inside. And actually when apples are formed, the skin forms first to protect everything going on inside. So when we create a new apple, the skin protects it. That's like God, God the Father, who creates and protects. Inside the apple we have the white part. This one's a little bit brown because it's been in the air. And that's called the flesh. We also have flesh. And Jesus became flesh. So Jesus the Son, he's the flesh, the second part. And then deep inside the apple we have seeds. I don't know if you can see them in here. But the seeds actually are inside and they can help start new growth. And that's kind of like our Holy Spirit. It's the seed of God that we understand and helps us start new things with God. So those are like the three parts of God, the triune God, the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit.